Hi everybody, I'm Fatma from Addictive Tips and I'm going to show you how you can check your SSD's health on Windows 10. There are a ton of apps out there that let you check your SSD's health. Uh, unfortunately, there's nothing that comes uh, out of the box in Windows 10. I recommend that you try this app called Crystal Disk Mark. It's a free app. Download and install this app and then run it. It's going to tell you what the current state of your SSD is. Uh, under this health status, if it says it's good, then you don't have anything to worry about. For some SSDs, it's also going to give you a health percentage. Uh, it ought to be 100% if you have like a fairly new SSD. The percentage is based on how much data you've um, written to your SSD since you started using it. Now, for some SSDs, this information may not be available, and in that case, you won't get this um, health percentage. If you want a second opinion on the health of your SSD, you can try an app called Open Hardware Monitor. Now, this app tells you a lot of different things about your hardware, but once you download and install it, you need to um, expand your uh, SSD from this uh, list of devices on your system. There's um, a levels section under your SSD, expand it, and it's going to tell you what the remaining life for your SSD is. Mine's sitting at 96%, which is a bit uh, unusual c considering I've had it for like uh, less than two years. Now, both these tools are perfectly reliable, but there's another tool that a lot of people recommend using. It's called SSD Life. There's a professional version for it and a free version that you can download from Softpedia. The free version tells you if your disk is healthy or not, and uh, if you need like a third opinion, this app ought to do the trick. If you think the app is worth it, you can upgrade to the pro version and uh, get a little more information about your SSD. An SSD has a limited life. Your SSD isn't going to expire in a year or two, but you should still keep an eye on when its lifespan is about to be over so that you can keep your data backed up and uh, avoid any data loss. I'll see you later with more tips and tricks for Windows 10.